Welcome back to the another video of Cricket Thrills. Sir Faraz Nawaz is born on 1st December 1948 in Lahore. He is a former Pakistani test cricketer and politician who were instrumental in Pakistan's first test series victories over India and England. He is known as one of the earliest exponents of the reverse swing bowling. Being 6 feet 6 inch tall, Sir Faraz was described as strong as a cart horse and his powerful upper body and good action allowed him to bowl at a fast medium pace. He could see the ball in either direction and despite the convention, he repeatedly bounced other fast bowlers such as Jeff Thompson and Joel Garner. The big burly Punjabi bowler Sarfraz Nawaz formed a potent partnership with Imran Khan and was one of the pioneers of reverse swing bowling. His most prolific spell came in the Melbourne Test of 1978-79 but he kept going admirably on some heartless test pitches in Pakistan. He had all the ingredients of a potent fast bowler, a strong action, bouncer, yorkers and swings, both conventional and reverse. He was so effective that he generated good lift on a docile subcontinent tracks too. He is the more remembered for his spell from hell, 9 for 86 against Australia at MCG in 1979. He also served Northamptonshire with distinction in two stints. As a lower order batsman, he often swung his bat and got quick runs. And and he averaged over 40 in a series on three occasions. He attached a few controversies as well. Sir Faraz Nawaz controversially dismissed Australian batsman Andrew Hildish for handling the ball in the next test at Perth after his spell from hell. His withdrawal from a home series against England also created quite a fit of anger. Sir Faraz Nawaz proved himself a fast medium bowler of a class act, a tough customer at most times who possessed an absolute accuracy while bowling. His ability to hit the ball while batting lower order made him a useful mini all-rounder and he was the third Pakistani to take 100 test wicket and score 1000 test runs. He possessed a good action and the ability to seam the ball with equal effectiveness both ways. On March 15, 1979 at Melbourne, he bowled a memorable spell to take 9 wickets in an inning. He dismissed 7 batsmen while conceding just one run from 33 balls. He was a highly controversial player due to his unconventional conventional behavior and mood swings and bowled a succession of bouncers at other fast bowlers such as Jeff Thompson and Joel Garner. Once protesting about his pay, he flew to England during a test series between the two teams in Pakistan. The flat wickets found in Pakistan were not ideal for a bowler of his pace but could sometimes surprise batsmen with his ability to make the ball seem swing or bounce awkwardly. More importantly, with Sikandar Bhak, Sir Faraz Nawaz developed a reverse swing partnership commentators did not realize this was reverse swing at that time, though they realized that he had an uncanny ability to move the old ball in the air. He passed off his knowledge to Imran Khan, Wasim Akram and Wakar Yunus, who made his new type of bowling famous in the late 90s and the early 1990s. As a batsman, he was a good lawyer order striker of the ball, particularly when driving, and averaged over 40 in a series on three occasions. Following his retirement, Sir Faraz Nawaz plunged into the complex world of Pakistan politics, he became an outspoken MP and cricket commentator. Between 1969 and 1984, he played 55 test matches for Pakistan and he took 177 wickets at an average of 32.75 with the best of 9 for 86, including 5 wickets 4 times and 10 wickets in a match 1 time. He also scored 1,045 runs with the highest score of 90 at an average of 17.71, including 450s and 26 catches. In 45 ODI matches, he took 63 wickets at an average of 23.22 with the best of 4 for 27 and also scored 221 runs with the best of 34 at an average of 9.60, including 8 catches. In a long first class career, he played 299 matches in which he took 1,000 1005 wickets at an average of 24.62 with the best of 9 for 86, 46 times 5 wickets in an innings and 4 times 10 wickets in a match. He also scored 5709 runs with the best of 19 at an average of 19.35 including 17 50s and 163 catches. In 228 list matches, he took the 319 wickets at an average of 20.88 with the best of 5 for 50. Five wickets in an innings three times and he also scored 1721 runs with the best of 
192 including 350s and 43 catches if you like this video please comment share and subscribe thank you very much